The next day, Mojo summoned up the courage to go back to the pool. But the high dive still had the upper hand. Just then, he heard Katie. Forget about the high dive for now. You'll get there eventually if you just keep taking small steps forward. That's the staircase strategy. Oh, that's the staircase strategy, said Mojo. Yeah, I don't get it. Remember how you ate that giant cotton candy at the fair last year, said Katie. Best day of my life. And remember when I said you couldn't do it? <laughs> of course I can do it. I just gotta keep taking bites. Exactly, said Katie. Big challenges can be scary. But there's a trick. You don't have to take on the big challenge all at once. You can break it up into teeny tiny steps. Then all you have to do is focus on the next step. Every time you take a step, you get braver. And when you get braver, you can take on even bigger challenges. But be careful. If you try to take steps that are too big, you might give up. But just make the steps smaller. Take enough small steps and you can do things that used to seem impossible. Katie, you're a genius, said Mojo. Then he turned to the high dive. I'm coming for you, big boy, he said. And Mojo kept taking steps, just like Katie said. Until, after many small steps, he found himself back atop the high dive. His heart pounded. His legs froze. But this time, something was different. He knew he didn't have to give up just because he was scared. All those small steps had made him braver. So instead of climbing back down to safety, he took one step toward the edge, then another, until finally there was only one more step to take. Now what do you think? Have you ever conquered a big challenge by taking small steps? Hmm, now that's an interesting question indeed. <laughs>